it's really fun to see everybody's costumes. We are still months away from Halloween, but people at the U of I Vet Med Clinic got all dressed up today. They wanted to show support for one of their coworkers. She lost a son last year. WCI3's Anna Carrera is now here now, and he loves superheroes. They wanted to carry on that tradition, which is so sweet. Oh, it really was. Uh, Ian uh, really loved Buzz Lightyear. That was his favorite. And there was a wide variety, as you saw, of characters out there today. So on two legs or four, they decided to pay tribute to this little boy. Kelly, take a four by four and wipe off that blood. People who work at the U of I Vet Med Clinic have a lot of special skills. Hello, pharmacy! You might even call them superpowers. Being a radiologist, I'd probably say x ray vision. A lot of them are even dressing the part. Underneath, of course, I have my fancy um, Batman scrubs that are nice and clean and protected. It's a fun day to be walking these halls. I think my kids were a little embarrassed to see me leave the house like this today, but once I got here, I felt like I fit right in. But there's a reason behind the outfits, and his name is Ian. Today was inspired by him because he inspired so many of us here to uh, find our inner superhero and be the best clinician and the best person uh, we can possibly be. Ian's mom works with everyone here. Along with superheroes, they say he seemed to like animals, too. His mom took videos of him watching cat videos online, and he would love watching the cats. And um, almost he would, he would watch it over and over again to the point where he'd lose his breath laughing so hard. People who knew him say his death happened just that suddenly. They're remembering him one year after he died by channeling their inner superhero. Mrs. Incredible spent her day in the wildlife center. After having two kids and running the wildlife clinic and mentoring students, I feel like I can channel her and, and be pretty effective. The rest of the gang assembled out here. They say it's the least they can do to support a family that has become a part of their own. <laughs> love that, huh? I love that that they assembled. I caught that. They did that. They well, and this was all kind of quick. They put this all together just in the last couple of weeks. But they want to make this an annual thing and watch it grow from here, just to remind people, you know, this little boy who inspired all of them. Absolutely. And why do kids get to have the the fun of being <laughs> able to dress up? And they're they're doing it for a good reason. Mm -hmm. All right. Thank you, Anna. Okay. Now we are going out to our superhero. What would be your power, Derek? If you had one. Oh, with, yeah, I had no clue you were talking about me. I don't know what my power would be. I'd like to be able to run faster. That's one thing I'd like to be able to do.